believe me, if you will bring presents to her children, she will always appreciate it, she will be happy, and her attitude will be quite opposite immediately. If she is still even not sure, she will be very, very, very happy and grateful for you if you care about her child. Okay, guys, let me give you tips about um, six main, the most adorable and expectable presents in Ukraine for Ukrainian ladies. And I hope it will help you in your future relations or if you're planning to come very soon here to Ukraine. The first one is flowers. Believe me, all girls adore flowers from youngest till oldest. So you will never miss, you will never lose if you will buy her flowers. She will always appreciate it and she will like it because it's still considered to be sweet and romantic as a sign of your adoration. So please always try to be with the flowers at least for the first dates, okay? The next one second is your care and attention. Care's attention is one of the most important and expectable things from men because I think this is the best one. So give this to her as well together with the flowers. The next one uh, perfumes but we talk about perfumes only when you're sure about the brand or type of smell she prefer and only when you're sure Mm, you have a relations because real original perfumes can be quite expensive. So if you buy just some fake, mm, it's up to you. But if you would like to please her with original, true perfume, so mm, just needs to wait a bit until you're confident about her and relations with her. So the next one also romance tours. This also advice for the people who are already in relations and if you know each other very well you would like to spend more time with her and probably she's dreaming about um, tour to Italy. So you can please her easily if you can afford this and if you know she's dreaming about Italy believe me every woman will be happy for one million percent if you will give her tickets for a cruise or some tour, romantic tour, no need to Italy, maybe Paris, maybe Thailand, whatever, maybe Bali, I don't know, just needs to listen to her attentively. Sometimes she, if she doesn't ask you directly, she can give you some tips and hints or maybe speaking over the phone with one of her friends and who came already and who enjoyed it much and who uh, share her experience and you see she's quite of envious a bit, you know. So you can help her with this if it's okay for you. If you're already a couple, why not, guys? Together you can spend a very hot and amazing time on a romance tour. The next one, the fifth one, is jewelry, guys. I know that all of you already know that probably women all over the world crazy about gold, diamonds, some of them about white gold, silver, whatever, platinum. So. Uh, this type of presents, of course, very precious and considered to be luxurious ones. But also, I don't want to tell you once again, such presents you can always present only for the special occasions and only to worthy, appropriate lady in which you are sure for 100% and with which you already have very good and strong relations, so you plan your mutual future. Of course, in this case, she will always be happy to get such a precious present from you as a sign of your love. Okay, and the next one, the last six, is money. Money, don't think about money. It's the same like when you have very close relations. Maybe it's already your wife or girlfriend. So uh, if you don't know what to give her as a present and if she's still also not sure about what she would like to get and you just can simply ask her, uh, what kind of present you would like to get, my dear, for this special occasion? And if she still not decide or not sure, you can give her just a specific amount of money which you consider to be appropriate and which you can afford uh, in a nice envelope. It's okay. And when she's ready, when she knows what she wants or maybe she plans to buy something expensive, maybe some facility or equipment for her house 
or I don't know for what, maybe she tried to save money, uh, planning to buy something. So it also will be okay, but not for the first time, of course, not for the first date and only for the person with whom you're in relations already. So be careful and why. So guys, remember that your presence, the level, the quality, of your presence it's kind of love language and according to what you give her as a present she will understood what is her what is your intentions and what is your plans and how much you care about her and what your plans for her so be careful in this moment please guys as for the presents for the lady I think I mentioned what needs to buy and one what don't need to buy but I want to mention two very important points in this situation which can help you really to be successful. And I'm sure some of you probably thought about this, but maybe not all of you. I'm talking about if you're going to start dating with a single mother and if she has a child. Guys, don't miss it. This is really very important. And never forget about child when you come to see her even first time you know I think you need to buy even more presents for her child even for lady herself because you know the way to the lady's heart lie always through her kid so if you want to make a good impression if you're planning to start to build friendly relations at least for the beginning with her child and you want to become in future a good father or maybe just a friend it will be also quite enough if the child will accept you as a friend and the child will trust you and uh, can share with you some thoughts ask your advice it will be perfect guys so please remember kids are always kids all over the world what they like what they enjoy sweets amusements and toys it's quite easy guys just three main things the more sweets the best M&Ms chewing gums chocolate different candies whatever toys appropriate for the specific age if you're planning to meet single mother you can always ask and I, I, I am sure you know already uh, what age she has a child of so you can ask uh, at the supermarket or if you're planning to buy some toy what will be very good for this specific age believe me if you will bring presents to her children she will always appreciate it she will be happy and her attitude will be quite opposite immediately if she is still even not sure she will be very 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 happy and grateful for you if you care about her child so guys please very important topic don't forget to bring some sweets or toys maybe to her child it can really can help you to become successful in future relations with this specific lady and also guys one more very important thing ladies mom <laughs> believe me mother-in-law this is separate topic to be discussed and uh, our Ukrainian mothers-in-law are considered to be the most scary thing for local Ukrainian guys and husbands. They have lots of jokes, anecdotes, even funny stories how mother-in-law treats and judges uh, her daughter's husband. So be very attentive. If this time you're planning to visit, to attend her parents' house, to meet with her parents maybe you're ready to make some proposal maybe she would like to get you acquainted with her parents to hear their opinion and idea about you and believe me serious and wise woman will always do it if she's sure in you if she plans in her mind to have something with you in future and if she's sure you're the right person you're the mr right for her please don't forget about your mom with her mom you are going to get the most serious judgment in your life and you're going to have really test drive so don't miss it guys as well this is very important like children and her mom even maybe more important when lady herself so for mom it's quite simple if you bring some flowers and some sweets it's perfect she will always appreciate but also 
I want to tell not just one chocolate, okay? Make it nice, make it creative in some box, maybe a few types of sweet. It will be very nice if it will be traditional from your country, from your native country. She will really like you and she will judge you from the top of your shoes up to your hairs. She will see everything, every detail in your costume, in your manners, even the way how you look at your daughter. Uh, how you serve her sitting at the table, she will notice every movement and she will judge you and even if the lady is not still so sure in you, her mother has a very huge influence on her daughter's opinion. If mama will consider you to be Mr. Right, believe me, she will do everything to convince her daughter that you are a very good match for her daughter. So guys, I wish you good luck in this difficult journey. You need to be very careful, wise, caring, attentive. Try to please your lady as much as you can. Believe me, she will give you double more. She will be thankful double more for you, for your care and attention. But be very careful. Never waste your money for the unworthy, inappropriate mercenary ladies who ask you for money or shopping at the beginning of your relations. Be very attentive, try to read her, uh, try to listen what she's talking about. And I hope with my advices you will be lucky and successful and uh, your lady will be quite happy to get such presents which I recommend you. And uh, I hope at the end of the day you will be happily married with Ukrainian lady which you would like to. So guys, I hope this episode was quite useful for you and I hope I managed to help at least some of you to have a better idea what to present, when to present and how to present and to whom. So please don't forget to subscribe our channel, to like our episode and to press notification bell not to miss our next episode, guys. I'm waiting for your feedback. Also, if you missed our previous episodes, you can find the links in the description below. I wish you good luck, happy journey, and I'm waiting for your feedback and opinions and next questions you would like to be discussed. Have a nice day, guys. Bye-bye.